so we have uh, Olya Badelka uh, from Belarus. Uh, uh, strong I am, I think, 2400 plus, and I uh, believe she's still a junior? Question mark. Anyway, let's go e5 for once. I mainly have been playing Sicilian, but. Oh! <laughs> okay. Okay. Somebody had to. Somebody had to. Somebody had to. Okay, props. And she is playing for Team Kramnik, and they desperately need a win. And she did, she goes ahead and does this. Okay, never mind. Never mind. We'll just play no castling chess. I'm sure... Yeah, she plays for Krim, Team Kramnik, who is a proponent of the non... No, I'm not going to repeat moves. Just once. Now I'm going to punish you. <laughs> I'm not going to give you a free draw. Like, who's going to watch that? Yeah, so now she has to play. She has to play solidly. Bishop b4, bishop c5, maybe. Uh, just gonna play f6, I guess. Bishop b, bishop b6. Develop normally. Not care too much about the non-castling. No castling thing. Maybe I could do something more violent, but like, if I can't castle myself, it's uh, it's sort of more more difficult to um, <laughs> uh, to um, to uh, to to mate quickly. Um, but I gotta give her props. Uh, she has the one chance to play against me and she goes ahead and bone clouds so <laughs> uh, it's both very silly and a little bit legendary at the same time i think would be a fair a fair assessment h4 maybe i'll just go run the other way just for fun, king d7 and then king c8. And just artificially castling queenside. You normally don't do that. I think Vlad and Vichy are playing a non no castling chess match later this year, if I'm not mistaken. I think it's pretty difficult to play because you gotta. It's a little bit, bit like playing playing uh, Fish Random Chess 960 in that if you just have a mindset that you try to make it a, a normal chess game as soon as possible, uh, you're probably going to lose because you, you aren't flexible enough to adjust to the new circumstances. Because it's, it, truth be told, it's very different from from normal normal chess, uh, especially some of some of the positions. And um, it's it's very interesting training, I think, in general. Uh, now we'll, we'll go e4 next. Um, and I certainly find it very difficult to play. Um, to to play a Fisher, uh, not enough to lose as poorly as I did to, to Wesley, even though he's strong at the format, little tactic here. Um, but still, yeah, it's, it's hard to play. And non-castling chess, I can imagine, is even, it's even tougher. Go knight e5, ideas of e3, after, after c4. Uh, okay, let's go queen c6. Try and be solid. Little trap, bishop b5, there was queen b5, rook a1, and rook c, rook. Oh, way too many arrows now. Way too many arrows. Um, as I said, I just drew my first arrow ever earlier today. So, I'm, um, 
not used to this. E3, I think. Queen. Queen F3. Oh, this wasn't so great because she has the trump in the ending here. Okay, this I think just loses. Rook A4, keeping it simple. We'll go and take another pawn. And she is playing fast, but I think at this point to no avail. Our idea is like queen h5 and then f4 winning. Mm 